So, uh, hello. I say hello to everyone who decided to spend with us this afternoon. So, uh, and decided to learn something new about the Tachograph solutions. So, welcome to our webinar, Tachograph Solution the Easy Way. So, take a comfort seat and enjoy. Today, we are not alone. With us participating real professionals of Taho Solutions. So, together with one of the leading telematics tachograph solution providers, Tachofresh and Mapon, we will discuss the opportunities offered by Taho Solutions. Our guests will present engaging success stories to show the real benefits of these solutions. So, today's agenda. Intro to Taho Solutions, which will contain European Union regulations, use cases, we we'll talk about three main components, tracker, tachograph models, software. Then will be time for success case from Tachofresh, success case from the Mapon. When we will present the answers for most asked questions, we will present supporting tools, installation instructions, connection options, card readers and other. So, let's go further, let's talk about the European Union regulations and according well-known regulation, uh, tachographs are mandatory in European Union. The purpose of tachograph is to prevent drivers fatigue and guarantee a fair competition as well as safety on the roads. Tachographs are devices fitted to buses and trucks they record the amount of time drivers spend driving and resting, as well as capturing data about the week. Uh, regulation says that uh, it's mandatory to install a tachograph in a new vehicle having a mass of more than 3.5 tons than the intent for the transport of goods. For new vehicles carrying more than 9 persons, including the driver, then they are intent for the transport of passengers. Furthermore, a smart tachograph version 2 will be fitted in newly registered vehicles as of August 2023. And in already registered vehicles engaged in international road transport operations by August 2025. As of July 1st of 2026, vehicles above 2.4 tons will be obligated to feature a tachograph. So you can imagine how big numbers of tachographs soon will be on the roads. Exist many different segments where Taho is being used. Most popular for sure is international logistics, where is used medium and heavy commercial vehicles. Then, of course, we should not forget national logistics. In terms of transport of goods in the national territory, Germany, France, Spain, the United Kingdom and Poland dominate European road transport measured in tons. These countries accounted for 60% of total goods transported in the member states of the European Union. Also, of course, commercial passenger transport. Around 800,000 buses are in operation through the European Union. Also, do not forget about the different types of heavy-duty vehicles, which also are obligated to have the tachographs for working hours control. Let's talk about facts and numbers. According to the European Automobile Manufacturer Association, there were 6.6 .6 million tracks on the European Union roads. As you can see, tendency is growing. So already today, when outside the window we have 2021, I'm sure that these numbers are even bigger. This association represents Europeans, car, dance, tracks, the bus manufacturers, all the biggest ones like BMW Group, DAF, tracks, Daimler, Renault Group, the Volvo Group, and many others. So I suggest to find this research 
and study it, this information will help you to understand the potential of your region or your country for Tahoe fleet management solutions. Just imagine that these huge numbers can be your potential customers. So, what it is Tahoe Solution? The three main components. The first of all, a telematics device, GPS tracker. The second, digital Tahoe graph. There's plenty different models of digital Tahoe graphs. And soon we will speak about the right ones. And of course, very important part of this solution is software. Exist many different software solutions according to your customer needs. You always can choose the right one which meets the, your customer needs the best. So, dear attendees, you are so lucky because soon few of software solutions you will be able to see during our live demonstration. And now I want to take a closer look to the topology picture. You can see here three main components. Digital tachograph, which is installed in vehicle. Teltonica telematics tracker, which makes it possible to read to read live data, such as present driver status, for example. The data can be read via K-Line, integrated K-Line, connected to D8 connector of Tachograph. Also, Tracker makes it possible to download remotely Tachograph and driver card files and transfer them to your office. In general, all data from Trackers can be transferred to the servers with dedicated software. It can be Teltonica Web Tahoe software, which is dedicated only for Tahoe data, or it can be other fleet management platforms, which can offer you many additional features like automated reports, driver penalties notifications, trip budget calculations, and many more. Please note that uh, for remote download of Tahoe activity files and driver card files on the server side, should be connected company card through a special card reader. It should be a duplicate of original company card, which every logistic company has. And now let's talk about a very important part, tracker. For Tahoe solutions, a perfect trackers are Teltonica FM630 professional series devices with wide range of functionalities. We have three models, FMB with 2G connectivity, FMC with 4G connectivity and fallback connectivities to 3G and 2G networks, and also the modern one, FMM630 with CAT M1 connectivity. All these models can read online data such as odometer data, but also can read all driver-related information like drive time, brake time, etc. All three models support remote Tachograph files download. Also, they support CAN data reading via standard FMS interface of commercial vehicles. So you can get all main vehicle's parameters directly from board computer. Do not forget about the powerful FM firmware platform, which allows to add a new features. FMC and FMM models uh, support Bluetooth connectivity, it allows us to expand functionality with various wireless sensors like fuel sensors, temperature sensors, axle load sensors, also allows us to use ID beacons for identification of connected trailers or track expensive goods or monitoring people. Also uh, professional series uh, devices support dual SIM feature. Also devices are equipped with two serial ports. It allows us to connect third-party devices like fuel sensors and carrier freezers, for example. Professional series devices have many digital inputs, analog inputs, uh, digital outputs, which makes it possible to connect various external accessories like panic buttons, buzzers, LED, LED lights and other uh, useful stuff. I want to remember that all our trackers are connected to powerful centralized cloud-based uh, photo server which allows you to update firmware and make changes of configurations for Oreo fleets just in few seconds. 
So make it sure that all your fleet is always up to date. And now, when we know which uh, Teltonica trackers are the best for Tahoe solutions, it's time to know uh, something new about the digital Tahoe graphs. So, that data is stored in memory inside the Tahoe graph unit. The records must be available for inspection by enforced officers that to check that laws are governing driver hours and rest times are fully compliant with. Uh, Tachograph itself collects such type of data like uh, driver card data, uh, Tachograph activities, events and faults uh, reports information, and some general information about the Tachograph. And all this data is possible to read remotely by using our Tachograph solutions. Supported digital tachograph models are VDO Digital Tachograph DTCO of first digit generation, the newer one a DCO 4.0 of second digit generation, of course a stone rich tachographs also of first and the second generations, and soon we will officially uh, release the firmware with uh, support of FS Intellic Smart Tacho. Uh, versions of second generation. If you are not sure that your video Tachograph support, uh, supports a remote download, you can go to our website to tahoelookup.teltonica.lt, type the uh, part number and you will get all the main information about your Tachograph. It's a very useful tool to check the uh, possible connectivities from the, for example, a back connector of the Tachograph or the front connector, front panel connection. And soon we will update this database with new Stonebridge Tachographs. And third component is, of course, software. Teltonica is manufacturer of telematic devices, but also we have own software for remote Tahoe files download. Teltonica Web Tahoe solution is easily manageable and does not require any complex software installations. Everything is accessible via web page. So it's web-based solution. Uh, access to and download Tachograph files of your whole uh, fleet via simple web browser. Uh, we have also the automated shadows. Once you create a shadow, selected Tachograph files will be downloaded automatically. Data will be downloaded every defined period of time, for example, once a week or once a month, and etc. Files are stored on the server side and files can be downloaded directly from the website or automatically transferred via email or connected to an FTP server. Also, all the data is stored on the secured server and can be access, uh, accessed only by authorized users. Also, we support uh, multiple file formats like the standard uh, DDT file extensions and the uh, special ones for Spanish and French formats. So, you simply just need to set the required format on the Web Taho user settings. Also, there is the option to buy the standalone server license and install the Tahoe Web uh, Server solution on, on your own uh, servers. Or even more, if you have uh, your own R&D, we can provide know-how Tahoe remote protocols documentation. According to that, you can develop your own servers. And now, it's time for success story from our guests. Suzanne, please take a mic and tell us your success story of Teltonica telematics devices. Hi, Robert. Hi uh, to the audience. Thank you 
for the um, opportunity to uh, speak about Taco Fresh and our uh, solution. Yes, now I'm there. Hopefully, all can see the screen. Um, I'm managing director at Taco Fresh uh, GmbH. Uh, Taco Fresh is uh, has a long uh, history in the field of digital tachograph solutions. The business company was founded in 1995 and has its headquarter today close to Berlin. We are a software company with focus on digital tachograph solutions only. Uh, core product today is called Taco Fresh. It's a web-based solution that is distributed via a partner network in Europe. Uh, today, we have around 25,000 vehicles with our partners uh, that have a telematics box installed. A big part of that uh, also with the Teltonica device. And uh, we have a uh, host for our customers uh, driver data from 60,000 drivers. The system, uh, the web-based solution is multilingual. Our journey with Teltonica started uh, in second half 2017. Uh, we had focused from the beginning on the trackers that are capable of doing remote download. Together with Teltonica, uh, we adopted uh, special own Taco Fresh firmware for the remote download module and we also uh, worked closely together to implement on the trackers the so-called one minute rule to be calculated on the box itself. Um, the solution works similar and not unexpectedly to what uh, Robert already stated with uh, all uh, continental uh, video Taco graphs digital tachographs uh, with all stone rich tachographs from generation one and two, and uh, also with the latest uh, smart taco from Intellec uh, that is called EFAS. We have in total more than 8,000 trucks using Taco Fresh remote download and live solution with an FMC, uh, uh, FM, uh, FMB, FMC tracker from Teltonica. Um, what we will speak about today is a business case, use case, to stress the importance of live data that comes in addition uh, with the archived tachograph data, the historical live data, and have chosen the example of dispatchers. There are more than 260,000 dispatchers uh, across Europe that are responsible of uh, scheduling um, incoming transport orders uh, for um, the most feasible vehicle of the 6.6 .6 million trucks we had already heard about in the presentation of Robert. Each dispatcher, single dispatcher, has the challenge of managing an average of up 25 to 30 vehicles, including drivers and co-drivers. Among other tasks, uh, the dispatchers are responsible for ensuring that EU uh, regulations on driving, resting and working times are respected. In a very busy industry, dispatchers have to gather all relevant information from their drivers as quickly as possible, often still simply by calling them on their mobiles. Although there would be an alternative with the Taco Fresh life system giving them actual life information about driver budgets. The Taco Fresh Life module combines cost-effective tachograph solution uh, with tracking functions. All challenges in the hectic work of dispatching are answered with the Taco Fresh module live and incoming transport orders can perfectly be assigned within minutes to the best drivers and most applicable vehicles. Um, let's have a short look together and I hope it works. I uh, had some difficulties with that. Uh, together, very short on the live screen uh, to show what that means. I hope you all can see the screen. This is a live demo from a portal and our uh, demo fleet. 
what a dispatcher can see and will see with the Taco Fresh module live is all his vehicles on a map on the left side and he can see important information of the vehicles on the right side. So he would see that uh, the activity, actual activity of the vehicle uh, 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 here is work. The ignition of that vehicle is on. Uh, the driver's name is Hans. Um, he has not pressed the padlock, so all his live data is available. We see here when the next break is due, uh, the remaining daily uh, driving time, the remaining weekly driving time, the remaining uh, weekly uh, work time daily, and the remaining weekly work time. And we can see, uh, in addition, I have a little bit to shorten it, if he had any infringements today. When we uh, click on uh, one specific vehicle, you see all vehicles and driver information swap to the left. In the middle, you see the route driven that specific day. That means today. On the right hand side, uh, above bottom, you see a lot of information about the vehicle. Uh, again, you can see three buttons in the middle. Uh, you only see two here. It is driver activities, speed, and you would see infringements and warnings, notifications if there are any. Notification, for example, could be driving with our driver card, um, speeding, um, not take, ha having not taken a break, break or driving too long. At the bottom then you find all the detailed activities of a driver uh, uh, from the start of this shift. You see his, the, the working day of the week, it's the third day, you see his shift start, shift end, and as one of the major benefits, you see summary of driving time of this driver and the summary of the working time of this driver. Everything updated uh, frequently, latest uh, in a five minute sequence, you can change that and display it online. This is a very helpful tool uh, for dispatching and I will now come uh, to a summary of the benefits by just a second demo. The key benefits of the live module are to, or is to help the driver to find the most suitable vehicle and driver for a specific transport order. Uh, in detail or in principle, this means using live data via the eight connector of the digital tachograph, we respect and include working time regulation. The tachograph infringements are displayed online for the dispatcher to be visible. We have the one minute rule simulation included. All information not only available um, at the dispatcher's PC, but also on a tablet or smartphone, or if needed via API uh, for integration purposes into different applications. Uh, last and least, one of the major benefits of the solution is that with the same Teltonica hardware, customers are capable to do the remote download. Thank you very much. I hand over back to Robert, I assume. Thank you, Suzanne. It was very interesting. And now it's time for our second uh, success story. Uh, so I want to invite Mr. Ingus from Mappon Company. So Ingus, uh, please tell us your success story. Thank you for uh, having the opportunity to uh, attend in this, uh, this webinar. Uh, I'm uh, representing company uh, Mapon. Uh, Mapon uh, is a company developing uh, various uh, fleet uh, management uh, solutions. Uh, the core product of Mapon is uh, uh, obviously Mapon, the, the fleet management platform. Uh, we're in the market uh, something like 15 years already. And currently we keep track of uh, 100,000 units uh, on our platform. And, and the way we operate is we operate uh, either with the direct customers in several, uh, several markets 
either through the partnerships uh, in, in, in the rest of the countries. And uh, from the partnership perspective, we work uh, also under the white label business model, which means that if you are willing to have uh, this map on platform with your brand, then that's definitely possible. And uh, we started to work with the digital tachograph uh, solutions, uh, something like uh, in year uh, 2014. And, and uh, once we got the, the first uh, downloads uh, done, we actually understood that uh, we have to make sense of the data as well. And that's when we started to develop uh, Tachogram, which is a data analysis solution uh, that we have. And currently we are processing something like 150,000 uh, Taho files monthly. Uh, and uh, yeah, I will uh, briefly cover uh, the, the solution of Tachogram uh, later on. But the partnership with Deltonica is, uh, is in a way that uh, Deltonica is uh, one of the main uh, hardware suppliers for uh, Mapon and, and uh, our partner network. And uh, basically, all of the features or most of the features that are, are possible with the telephonic and telematics devices can be easily used with the map on uh, fleet management software. So uh, going, uh, going into the presentation part, uh, I would like to address uh, some of the uh, interesting uh, customer segments uh, that, uh, that uh, we have identified. And, and definitely one of the most important uh, segments for uh, remote download solution is definitely international transport where the vehicles are going abroad for uh, long periods of time, uh, for weeks, uh, sometimes months, or, or we have seen situations where the vehicles are uh, going on a full year trips and, and then returning back in the home country only to do the, do the MOT checking and, and things like that. Uh, nevertheless, uh, uh, also Robert was mentioning uh, local uh, transport companies, and then uh, we have identified that if the vehicles are split among several locations, then it's very uh, tricky for the customer to do the downloads, uh, keep track of uh, which vehicle was downloaded, which one was not. And the same thing applies to vehicles working uh, very long working hours. We have seen customers who are working uh, with uh, three driver shifts and, and uh, then it, it becomes complicated that somebody has to go outside of regular working hours to the customer, uh, to, the, to the garage and do the downloads. Sometimes it's happening on the weekends and uh, things like that. And if we are talking about the motivation of the companies, then uh, it's definitely fines. Uh, the fines are huge. Uh, if we're talking about some of the countries, then uh, the fines are, are can get as big as uh, several tens of thousands of euros uh, for, for uh, technical checking. And, and uh, this is uh, somewhat uh, very motivational for, for the companies. And automation as well. I mean, like everything that is done without human labor, that's, that's definitely a sales point uh, for, uh, for, for your sales uh, people. Uh, the topic I would like to address uh, in this, uh, this uh, short presentation is uh, infringement risk mitigation. Uh, I was already telling about uh, the fines that can get uh, up to several tens of thousands of euros. And in order to avoid fines, you have to keep track of uh, lots of uh, different stuff. Uh, you have to keep track of the remote download dates, uh, the driver files, uh, the vehicle files. Also, the top graphs should be calibrated every two years. And then uh, if you miss the calibration, you also get a fine. Uh, card expirations, I mean the driver card expirations, which means that if the driver is going on the route with the expired driver card, then uh, the Tahoe at some point just uh, spits out the, the card and, and uh, the driver cannot go any further. And uh, of, obviously the work and rest time rule infringements, uh, which uh, according to our understanding, uh, there are very rare cases when the drivers intentionally break the rules, uh, but basically most of the infringements are because of the drivers not uh, trained enough and, and uh, not really understanding the rule complexity. So that's uh, that's what we have solved uh, by building Tachogram. And uh, yeah, the, the solution is, uh, is, is pretty straightforward. Uh, that's a web application and, and mobile applications uh, with easy to use dashboards, alerting system, and also uh, risk reports uh, and, and drive a debrief solution. So just to give a just to give a bit of uh, an understanding of what's uh, what's inside, uh, I'm switching over to the Tachogram demo account, and, and here you can see the dashboard. You can easily see how many of the drivers uh, are, are downloaded on time, how many are due soon. Uh, the same thing about the uh, vehicles, uh, vehicle calibrations. Uh, one one is uh, coming up. Uh, you can easily open it and, and check. Uh, when, when it's due. Uh, the same thing about the driver card expiration dates. You can keep track uh, when each of the drivers uh, should be uh, changing his, uh, his driver card. 
And also, when we are talking about uh, risk mitigation, it's important to note that uh, uh, you, you must have an easy to use uh, solution for identifying which drivers are, are violating the rules the most. So in this case, we have built a driver risk score dashboard, which uh, just identifies uh, uh, and, and uh, provides a score for, uh, for uh, each of the drivers, whether they are improving or, or, or are getting worse. And then you can just easily open up, uh, open up the specific driver, uh, see in the activity charts uh, what has uh, happened. And uh, for example, in this case, the driver has inserted the card while driving. He hasn't entered some data when, the, when he was inserting the driver card. And you can easily open up each and every uh, violation and, and uh, get, uh, get uh, the points in the regulation that are, uh, are uh, explaining why uh, there's an error. Uh, there are some, some uh, interesting tools for, uh, uh, for uh, making uh, your driver, uh, driver cases uh, in the, in the like, paperwork for, for the drivers. Uh, there are reports which you can uh, export in PDF and, and ask uh, the driver to sign that, uh, that uh, he has understood the violations. Also, uh, this will help for you uh, in the case uh, when the controlling institutions are coming to, to a checkup in the, in the company. And if you can provide a proof that you have been training and educating the drivers, then you can easily get, uh, get rid of some of the potential fines uh, which you uh, get uh, in case you don't have uh, this type of uh, information. Then, uh, then, of course, I was mentioning also the alerts. Uh, the alerts uh, is, is pretty straightforward. You can set up the alerts for each of the like, uh, due date uh, events, and you can also get some uh, some additional alerts about the infringements, about some special situations happening in the in the Tahoe graphs. And uh, as Robert was mentioning, the Web Tahoe solution. There is also an option to get uh, the files from external platforms. Like we also have an integration with uh, our uh, telematics platform Mapon. And, and uh, the situation with uh, Web Tahoe is, is the same. You can just easily set up uh, email integration and then, uh, then uh, get the files automatically into the Tahoe system for, for analysis. And uh, finally, I, I would uh, say that uh, the, the last uh, important bit is, is, is the fact that uh, we have built also the driver application. Uh, the application also includes an option to download the DDD files via external card reader, but I would say that the most important bit is actually uh, providing the access to the data for the drivers, which is, uh, which is very important uh, due to the new mobility package improvements uh, into regulations. And, and uh, now there's a situation that uh, the drivers have used uh, to following the data on the tachograph screens, but unfortunately due to the mobility package uh, changes, it's, it's uh, like uh, the tachographs cannot be that easily updated. And, and there are cases when the tachographs are uh, showing the wrong information on, on, on the screens. So having an option for the drivers to see uh, the data, uh, analyze data, precise data on their, their mobile phones uh, is, is uh, very important according to our understanding. So yeah, I think that's, uh, that's it from, uh, from my side. Uh, if you are willing to get some more information about the solutions, then uh, feel free to reach out. And, and uh, thank you once again, Robert, for, for having us uh, here in this webinar. I'm giving the back word to you. Thank you, Ingus, for your detailed uh, demonstration of your solution. It was really, really interesting. And now it's time for FAQ and Maybe you think that uh, to start business with uh, offering the Taho solution is very difficult and complex. So I want to change this stereotype. Uh, with uh, professional help, all this is. And we are here uh, to help you, to Tonica and the partners. Uh, we have all required tools, uh, all required uh, devices, softwares and other stuff to to do it so uh, and first of all I want to mention a Teltonica wiki page where you can find all the needful information in the one place uh, a configuration examples instructions of installation the debug tools like for example a live Tahoe SMS uh, debugging 
then after the connection uh, after the installation and connection the tracker with tachograph you can send special sms to tracker and tracker will try to initiate connection we will try to initiate remote downloading and will respond you with sms of the real status of the connection and if something is wrong they uh, in sms you will see this information and you will see that what exactly you need to check so also uh, i want to mention a, a solution with front panel connection uh, where with special cable you can connect to the taho it's very easy uh, to set up it it means the uh, low costs also it is solution which is 24/7 uh, uh, active it means that all the time the server can send request and download all the data from a tachograph and game changer here is that the, this solution allows us to use the tracks with 12 volts systems the like light vehicle tracks also in our wiki page we have detailed instruction how to enable and how to use front panel connection also i want to mention about the uh, card readers i already mentioned in our topology that on server side should be connected uh, special card readers and leslie hyper card rack is one of such a solution it's a very scalable solution because you can connect a lot of different uh, company cards here. There's no limitation of the connections. So you can connect up to uh, 6,000 uh, uh, cards on the one PC. And this type of, of readers uh, uses less space. So it's a very useful thing and very useful uh, solution also i want to mention about other um, about other uh, useful uh, accessories which uh, you can buy from uh, toltonica like a special taho cables like a special fms connection cables uh, like uh, special uh, card readers so do not uh, forget to visit our website and check out our accessories. So how to start? To test Taho solutions and bring even uh, more value for your clients, please do uh, the following steps. If you are not a Teltonica customer yet, uh, you can contact us via email, which you can see on the screen, info at Teltonica LT, and our sales managers will contact you. If you are already a business partner of us, you can contact your account manager and ask for more information and for test samples, for example. Uh, if you have uh, technical questions and you are already our partner, you can use our Teltonica VIP help desk service. Or if you have some other technical uh, doubts or questions, you can try to uh, find the answers of on our wiki page or ask our engineers through our crowd support forum. If you are interested in our guests' uh, software solutions, uh, you can contact them via emails, which you can see on your screen right now. I want to remember uh, to subscribe our uh, newsletter and follow us on the social media uh, to get the latest Teltonica Telematics news, uh, events and notifications including announcements of new products and solutions, important product change notifications, new use cases and usage scenarios, market insights, invitations to upcoming webinars, um, installation tutorials, and many, many more. So, thank you for your time. Uh, stay safe and see you soon on our next webinars. Thank you and goodbye.